an organization for good and accountable government in Dominica. Why? Well, we felt that after 14 years, no, sorry, 16 years of independence, and with the, how should I put it, fast approaching 21st century, we felt that the time was right for an organization such as ours to focus for the time being on eight fundamental matters, eight fundamental issues, to ensure and to maintain the institutions of good government that we inherited and to ensure that the functionality of government was such that the citizen of the state understood the nature of the government, had a sense of obligation to the citizen of the state, and acted in accordance with what we considered to be the basic fundamental principles of good and accountable government. All right. These eight fundamentals are, <clears throat> Brother Jimmy. First of all, the appointment of a parliamentary commission an independent director of audit with power to make or institute inquiries and, to investi and investigations and to make recommendations to the appropriate authority with a view to further investigations or prosecution. Three, an independent tender board and the publication of criteria and guidelines for the purposes of tenders and the obtainment of fiscal incentives. Four, freedom of and access to information. Five, access to the courts and the administration of justice within a reasonable time. Six, a maximum two terms for the office of prime minister. Seven, legislation to prevent ministers of government, members of cabinet and parliament from entering into contracts or doing business with the government or its institutions or statutory boards, either in their own name or the name of companies owned or controlled by them. There is, if I may mention, the eighth one, which was not stated on here, the fact that we felt that the, the municipal laws, the laws of the Commonwealth of Dominica, should apply equally to statutory boards, government controlled institutions, and certain aspects of government like itself, like payment of income tax, the filing of financial statements, consumption tax, custom duties, etc. 